Welcome to the One Up Factory, where they have all of your Super Mario needs, including your plush keychains, popcorn buckets, shirts, gloves. They got everything here. So, oh my gosh. They even have these Mario and Luigi hoodies? Hoodie onesies? What do you call these? Do you sleep in this or do you go trick-or-treating in this? You can wear this for Halloween, totally. It's going to set you back a nice $60. Wow. Um, good. What does this convert into? Hold on. 30 bucks. Convert into a star? There you go, you were right. A star. Wow. It's a saggy star. <laughs> I gotta, I can't do it right. There you go. And then right along the same wall, you have some Mario and Luigi plushies. No, look at that. The left side is gonna have all of your Mario favorites, so a different size plush Mario with some cups, your Mario hats, Mario shirts. Although I'm, I'm a little sad they're not selling the same kind of hat that Mario wears. This is like a baseball cap, but Mario has like his own signature hat. Like, I want that. On the right side, however, you have Luigi. So pretty much everything the same except for the cups. They're different. Luigi has his own mug, whereas Mario had a cup. And then also your Luigi baseball caps and your shirts. But wait, there's more. Because right over here, for all of you Peach fans, you have your Peach shirts, both in youth and adult sizes, as well as cups and mugs. So you don't have to miss out on one of them. You can actually just get either the cup or the mug. And also these little, like, backpacks. Like father, like son, we got Bowser Jr. with his shirt. This is going to be $30. And Bowser has his own shirt with a Bowser plushie. He's looking like he gained a little weight since uh, Mario 64. Uh, oh, poor Bowser. Alone, poor Bowser. They had a Mario burger. Leave him alone. And they have plenty of kid sizes as well. So it's not just for adults in here. They also have some kid size clothing and apparel. So everyone gets to take a little bit of Mario home with them. And this wall is featuring our beloved dinosaur lizard hybrid, Yoshi. Also with mugs and cups. How come Mario doesn't have a mug? Everyone else has a mug except for Mario. Oh boy, I think this is going to be my favorite wall. This has a ton of plush. A piranha plant plush? A toad plush? What? Looks like more like a Christmas tree ornament. A chomp plush? They got it all. Wow. I mean, look at They got Blooper. They got Chef Toad. They got Boo. They got Regular Toad. Yoshi. Piranha plant. Chain Chomp. Goomba. Too bad they don't stick on your shoulder like at Disney. I know, they need like little magnets so they can just hop on your shoulder. And over here they have a smaller size Bowser plush as well so he can fit nicely on your shelf. This is probably as close to a shoulder plush as you're gonna get, except he's gonna go on your head. All right, my boy Luigi. Luigi's number one. How does it look? It looks like a goo. It's a little loose. Yoshi has his own hat as well. Yeah. It's a little too snug for me. <laughs> I have to adjust it. Hold on. I have a big head. You have a lot of hair. Ooh. I'm pretty sure there's a Yoshi headband too, because I've seen people with it, but maybe they just ran out. I think I like this hat though. Mario Kart since 92. That's pretty rad. Which also, you have this little the metal sign, Mario Kart since 92. All the OG people need to have this in their room. 
And then right alongside it, they also have a no shell zone sign. Over here on this side, you do have your Starman popcorn buckets, as well as your mushroom Nintendo sipper. Oh, I thought it was a popcorn bucket. It's actually a sipper with a little space for the straw on top. And they didn't have them on the wall, but they also have a Babam plush. Oh. So they have all the villains, uh, mo most of them at least. A couple that are missing. Why can't you twist it? That would be cool. Now that was just the left side of the store. There's a whole other right side with different merch from that side, including more plush, backpacks, signs, shirts. Can't forget the chocolate. So just in case your sweet tooth needs a little bit of a fixin, they have some chocolate bars. The other day I did see some other varieties like dark chocolate and chocolate with nuts, but it looks like they only have Mario's milk chocolate. So that's all you have for now but I know there are other kinds that you can get. So check it out. Right here on this wall, you have some vintage Mario Kart shirts. Mario Kart at the Grand Prix. You have these like crop top sweaters, the gray shirts. These ones are looking kind of retro. This one has Bowser on it. Whereas this one just has Mario on it. And then you have some patch sets. So if you have a like a Letterman jacket or something, you want to throw some patches on there, go right ahead. What are these? I think... Oh, I think these are magnets. So Super Nintendo World magnets. Oh my gosh. But this backpack, it has a seat belt for a, a, like a little clip. Oh my gosh. Wow. That's legit. Universal, you gotta, you gotta get started on the pin collection here. The pin trading. If you can pin them on your new Mario bag or Yoshi bag that you get, right? Or you can pin them on this backpack, which has a seat belt for a clip. Oh, wow. Look at that, wow. Are these Definitely no shortage of apparel over here. There is a mushroom piston engine sign, some different variety of hats and shirts. They also have these keychains. So if you want to put your annual pass or something on it, you yeah, got your keychains, as well as these retro Mario Kart 92 hats. I think everyone needs a set of these though. These bad boys. Gotta have them in the closet. 60 bucks for this guy right here. 60? 60 bucks. And if you want a smaller one, there's a smaller Mario, it's 30 bucks. But 60 bucks for this guy right here. Big M. And on this wall, you are gonna find similar plush to what we saw over there. The same characters, your Goombas, Bloopers, Babombs, Chain Chomps, Chef Toad, all those guys. Just not your main characters like Yoshi, Mario, Luigi. Oh, but this over here, this shirt is featuring Boo, which not, none of the other villains got their own shirt except for Bowser, but Boo got his own shirt, because why not? And if you come over here to this station, you do have some keychain characters featuring Mario, Luigi, Shy Guy, haven't seen him yet. And we also have Lakitu. So these guys specifically want to go on your keychain because they have the carabiner already embedded in them. But if you come around, there's actually some character lanyards. So they have all your characters like Peach, Mario, Luigi. But this is probably what you're gonna want to put your annual pass in. So they have lanyard pouches and you can get a lanyard strap to go with it. Shy guy, I totally forgot about him. I haven't seen him in years. And they do have some fun little games over here like stackable Yoshis. How many Yoshis can you stack? with some collectible figurines. There's a Yoshi figure. I saw some Mario and Toad as well. And all of your fairy characters in a pen form. As well as, what is this? Mint? Brick breaking jawbreaker candies. Oh. So we got a little candy corner over here. Nintendo Mushroom Sours. Sour Cherry. These are those character figures I was talking about. So here's your Mario and your Chef Toad, but I don't see Luigi or Peach, so maybe it's only a couple of characters. And last but not least, you do have your power-up bands behind the counter, so if you want one, you just have to ask a team member to help you with those. But don't forget, you can also buy the power-up bands right outside next to the Piranha Plant minigame, so either here behind the counter or outside next to the game at the self-serve kiosk. Either way, you're gonna get the same power-up band and all the same activities. But as far as inside the 1UP factory, hopefully this was a good glimpse as to what you can expect here for all of your merchandise and your apparel needs. There's a lot of fun stuff in here. 
and I know that they sold out with those Mario, Luigi, Toad, and Yoshi hats. So hopefully those will be restocked soon because those look really fun. Maybe they'll be restocked for your visit to Nintendo World. If this was helpful, make sure to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe, and we'll catch you guys on the next Dream Park adventure.